I'm fired up today. <laughs> today is the day we're gonna try to buy something really good. Let's hope George so. George Slayer in the public storage caravan. You want to just give up your plan. If I can get Come something on. cheap, I'll get it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's going for something cheap. I'm gonna go for the best freaking locker I can see. I'm gonna get something. God, I hope. Wish me luck. God damn it, I'm fired up today. He smooth is in the house. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want to give up your plan today? I'm looking for those boxes, some yeah. good stuff. Yeah. Uh, I need some more jewelry. Yeah. When I got in here, I didn't just kind of looked at it. I didn't go through it. Other than one box, I saw there were diapers. But this, I'm not happy with it. Okay. What do we got, you say? I think I bought a turd, but I'll show you. I'm gonna set up the tripod and we'll look through this crap. We'll go at, we'll go at it like we're killing snakes to quote Trey Bell, but uh, I don't think we're gonna get our money back on this one. And a lot of times when you have a big buy, you, you make a lot of profits, you come back and here you get slammed back down to reality. Cause this didn't look like this to me on the phone when I was bidding. And she was talking about all the tubs in the front. Well, I couldn't really see. Well, there are a lot of tubs, and they're all freaking empty. So, anyway. Oh, yeah, and uh, my buddy you saw in the beginning of this uh, storage, Slayer, bought one yesterday for $100. It was a 5x5 five five stuffed with boxes. He started opening up. Roaches were running around everywhere because they stored food in there, and he said he probably gave away $100 yesterday. And my buddy Jay... Uh, he bought one for 150 and he's going to get his money back and maybe make a profit. Maybe. He does eBay, so he'll probably make a little bit. But uh, oh, anyway, I'll get back um, with the tripod. See you in a second. Oh, no. That's no good. <clears throat> we can probably sell it. And here's another box of them. Uh... Bladder leaks, oh boy. Yeah, that's great. What do you think? We've gone from golden antiques to bladder leaks here. And all the tubs in the front that they were describing. Oh yeah, I couldn't see this, but I'm finding tubs in the front. Frickin' empty ones. Look at that. It's for nothing. Oh boy. I got tubs coming. Look at this. When you're describing a unit and you say there's a bunch of tubs, I guess you can say that. But I couldn't see on a two inch screen, and so what do I get? Oh boy. This is a bad, 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 bad. Now we've got these boots. Of course, I buy storage units, so I've got a thousand pair of them, all right? comes down can I sell these maybe and they're not even that good ah, ten bucks if I'm lucky All right. I can't really complain because we're coming off a couple of good buys but but y'all this one sucks from the beginning now here's why I bid on the unit here's the pop-up you might ask, where's the rest of it? Well, it's right here, I think. No, it's not. Okay, we just bought a pop-up. We just bought a freaking pop-up without, without the... So the pop-up is nothing. Zip. Zilch. Here's some more diapers. We got a bunch of them. What do you think of that? Very little money there, Penny. Oh, God. Yeah, I took the corn on this one. Okay. We got a cooler. No wheels. It's a Coleman. 10, 15 bucks. I got a cord and some. bitty shovel. Zip. Zilt. What do 
do you think of that? That needs to clean up. I'll have to work about 15 minutes on that to get $15. Buck a minute, that's not too bad, but yeah. So we'll just write, we'll write this one off. This is a pile of crap. You see this? Get the most from peak performance. This is a this ain't no peak performance, alright? I'll show you peak performance. I'm gonna repurpose. Yeah, I'm gonna repurpose this alright. Back on it. Three hundred bucks get you a ramp, a pop-up, a mattress, a little stove, a garbage can, the rest of that's crap. We got a little power inverter here, you clip it on your battery, gives you a little juice, a little electric. We got some adult, adult uh, leakage diapers, three. And some ice melt. What do you think? How did I do this? You want to see a peak performance? Look at that. Two guys. There's a peak performance. Boxes. Yeah, I really needed those. What do we got here now? Oh boy. Hand warmers. I got about 10 bags of hand warmers. Okay, great, wonderful, all the above, all above. Look at this so far. Y'all want a good laugh? The ones that like to see me get really crappy lockers are gonna enjoy this one, so I really want to entertain everybody. So let's say a buck a piece, one, two, they're about $10 in hand warmers. Ooh, that is really good news, guys. Got a tool here, hyper tough, whoop-de-doo, five bucks. That's awesome, isn't it? Got a gas can, nothing. Cause I got so many, nobody's gonna buy a gas can. All right. Junk. Nothing. A cane, zip. You see this? That's a sh chair, crappy cooler, garbage can. Yeah, that's good and convenient because you could stick the whole thing unit in there. Okay. Here's the top to the uh, to the pop-up. So at least we got that, I guess. Boxes. Can use them. Didn't need them. Cheap little tent. Goose egg. A freaking. Uh, Light sensor grows. Are you are you serious? This unit. Oh, there's the box. Oh, there's a speaker. See all this crap here? Look at that. That is a pile of crap. Total blowout. Total loss of $300 right here. You see this? There's nothing here. Pile of shit. Gosh, you know. That's it. All right. There it is. You see that mess? hundred dollars plus to make that mess now 
sometimes when you buy these things, that's what you get. Be careful. I think this might have been the last month they're going to do those stupid bud by phones, but I don't know that. This is a disaster. So, there is something I want to show you. Check this out. Let's check out something good. This is the oldest gun I've ever found in a storage unit. Check this out. This is the oldest gun I have ever found in a storage unit. It's in terrible shape. It looks like it could be from the 16 or 1700s, seriously. It might have been recovered from metal detecting because it's in very bad shape, but it's still got its trigger. A little, I guess you put a cap in there, or whatever, not a cap, but a, I don't know what kind of, they, how they uh, used these back then, but this is the oldest one. I would say at least 300 years old. Just wanted to show you that. This happens. You have to be willing to lose money. These kind, you, what you do, you just absorb them. You just say, the hell with it, screw it. I'm gonna take a big fat ear of Indiana corn on this one, okay? Non-buttered, this one blows. Anything else you'd like to know about this? If you see any of these items you'd love to have, well, tell you what, you don't want them. This is a pile of crap. I got a hundred dollars here, guys. I paid three fifty, and I got a hundred dollars. What does that tell you? Does it tell me? Does it tell you that I'm an idiot? I don't think so. I feel like one, but I don't think I am. Because you got to look at the overall body of work. Now, I cleaned out this locker. I do what I'm supposed to do, whether the locker blows or not. Get my lock. Swept it out. Getting my bungee cord back. Okay. Nothing. Zip. Zilch. 